This movie will serve as an introduction to food deserts. This video will cover what food deserts are and why we care about them. What is a food desert? The Universal Declaration of Human Rights is a crucial international document stating the rights and liberties all human beings are entitled to. It states that all individuals should have a standard of living that allows them to satisfy their basic needs, like shelter, food, and water, among many other things. But how do we define access to these resources? How close do these vital services have to be for them to be defined as accessible? Many academics have been working on this definition for food. A food desert is classified as a region, which could be urban or rural, where residents don't have easy or affordable access to healthy food, either from grocery stores, farmers markets, or any other place that sells fresh produce. The U.S. Department of Agriculture has sought to create a measurable definition of this. According to their definition, in urban areas, residents have to travel one mile or more to access fresh produce for it to be classified as a food desert. In rural areas, this cutoff distance is increased to 10 miles. The average income in these communities is also taken into account when determining whether the region is a food desert since low-income communities are far less likely to be able to bear the costs of expensive fresh produce. The U.S. government uses this low-income cutoff and low-accessibility cutoff to determine how many people actually live in food deserts in the United States. According to their research, roughly 23.5 million Americans live in food deserts. Why do we care about food deserts anyways? Food deserts are becoming an issue of growing importance in the United States because of the implications they have on health and welfare of populations. For residents who live in a food desert, very often food is purchased from convenience stores or fast food restaurants where the high sugar, sodium, and fat contents of the foods purchased there increase their risks of obesity, which affects 35.7% of Americans, diabetes, which affects 9.3% of Americans, heart disease, which kills 25% of American adults, and many other diseases. The eradication of food deserts is increasingly becoming a goal of organizations seeking to reduce the prevalence of these diseases in America and increase the well-beings of individuals around the country. In conclusion, Food deserts are areas without easily available healthy foods. Roughly 23.5 million Americans live in food deserts. And food deserts contribute to the onset of major disease epidemics in America. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked my video.